Welcome, family and friends. We gather together here to join Veronica and James in the union of marriage. This union is not to be entered to lightly, but thoughtfully and seriously, and with a deep realization of its obligations and responsibilities. Two are better than one because they have a good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. This reading shares a true partnership between two people. The fundamental basis for being there for someone and the highs and lows is demonstrated here in the strength that comes from inviting Christ into your relationship. You are the flip to my flop. I will always be there for you to help and support you. You are the donut to my coffee. My coffee that will keep me going to take care of you through sickness and a cough. You are the beat of my heart. I vow to always cherish and honor you for all the days of my life. All of me loves all of you. All of your quirkiness, goofiness, and foolishness. The foolishness of having me wait so long, and therefore I will make you wait on me getting ready for the rest of your life. <laughs> you are a great man, a loving father, and strong partner. I am lucky to have found you and to have built the life we have. I vow to be your best friend, your faithful partner, and one true love for all the days of our lives. You are my lobster. I love you. I met James about, what, 10 years ago now? 10 long years ago. And I love you, James. You're my friend. When she's not available, I get to call you. <laughs> um, and you call me just as much. Um, you guys are good for each other. I love you. You know you're a part of our family. And that's it. <laughs> Do you remember the first day we met? I knew the first moment I saw you. I knew we were meant to be together. You have become my lover, my companion, and my best friend. There is no one else that I'd want to have by my side. Your love gives me hope. Your smile gives me joy. And you just simply make me a better man. I vow that I will love you and those two girls for eternity with everything I have.
Veronica, I am so happy my brother found you, like you said in your wedding deal. And your beautiful, amazing family from your, like I said again, your whole family. James is so lucky to have you, all of you guys. And Veronica, we have an amazing family too, and I know you love us, and our families are getting together, and now we are one. We are one big family. And I want to give a toast because this is my new sister-in-law. James and Veronica, we all love you. Veronica and James, today you have pledged your faith and love to each other in the company of two wonderful families and your circle of friends. By the power vested in me by the state of Florida, I now pronounce you married. James, you may now put your breath. 